channel and thank you for choosing this video i'm super excited guys because we are soon to be open our gift but before you start opening your gift they need to be designed very well in order to put a smile on the face of your loved ones and so I want to show you how to create different types of gift wrapping and also uh, different designs for you could uh, make it different this year. And if you're new, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell so you can receive notifications every time I upload a new video. Okay, so come with me for I can show you what you need in order to create all these amazing gift wrappings. <laughs> Okay guys, to start, uh, before we start, I just want to show you really quick what I'm going to be using for uh, this gift wrapping this year. And so I wanted to show you what I came up with and these are really great for amazing gift wrappings, guys. And I'm going to be using a few of these and plus other ones that I'm going to be showing you in, in, during my video. Plus I'm going to be using some of this paper wrap. Uh, gift wrapping. I'm not going to be using all of them except the black and white because that's new right now and so with the red inside and so that's cute and if I use these then I might use the white paper uh, the white the white paper yeah and I'm going to hide the other colors so to so start number one I am going to get a piece of garland plus this ribbon correct and so with this garland what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna cut a piece and then I'm gonna put a, and I'm gonna do a round circle just do it and just with the wire I'm gonna turn it around and to hold it in place and now to actually hold it in place with the box I'm gonna put some ribbon to hold it like this just like this really quick really nice guys um, I hope you really uh, like this because this is really nice I came up with this and I'm like oh I like it <laughs> so with this paper uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna write some letters right and I need a little help with my handwriting with my with my <laughs> with my letters right so I'm just gonna use this as the initial for I could start ahead of uh, doing my signed and then with my own handwriting, I'm just going to continue uh, forward. So it's really nice. Um, if you want me to create a design for you um, a, for Merry Christmas or in Spanish or whatever you want me to do, let me know. Um, and definitely, I could definitely create it for you. And I will upload it in my web page and you could definitely download it for free. And I'm really I'm, I'm really excited that you could definitely do that um, and you could definitely download it so just let me know guys let me know write it down in the question in the in the comment down below okay and so what I did is I inserted between the box and the garland and that's it I didn't have to cut anything or either glue it because it holds really tight it hurts it, it, it holds really nice so there you go there you have it this is a different way that you could uh, pack your or design a new way um, of gift wrapping this year so my second one is that I am going to place a frame a photo frame in top of one of these uh, in top of the box and so um, just to to give them the whole frame with the with the um with everything i left that side open right and what i did is i left that part open because i want to put the back of the frame a uh, back there for add for they could enjoy the frame as well if they want to toss it okay whatever um but just if i'm giving everything out just i'm just gonna give everything out and then I created this letters also pretty much the same thing and as the previous one and but this one is smaller so the letters are going to be a lot smaller and yeah so um so yeah I did this and it's really nice uh, it came out really nice with the frame and everything uh, it was something that I never done this before so yeah <laughs> 
So like you see, I put the, the, the crystal plus the base of the frame and then I put a paper on top of it, the, one of the gift wrapping paper on top of it, then I glue it in place. And then with this frame, I didn't use any glue because I just didn't want to mess up the frame. And so I hold it in place with this uh, yarn, white yarn. I, I think this white yarn, um, it was okay for me. If you have gold, it will be much better and, and some other colors. But, um, but yeah, but the white one, it came out really nice. It came out really nice. It, I wasn't too scared at all. <laughs> okay. Um, now after that, after I hold it in place, I am going to add gold. You could buy this at the Dollar Tree for $1 and it looks really nice. Plus the frame as well. So it's really it's really nice really economic and you're not gonna spend too much money right this gift wrapping paper uh the red one with black inside you find it in walmart okay so now i'm gonna be using this round box right and it's totally awesome because you can fit a pretty nice uh, red, uh sweater inside so and even more um so yeah so what I did is I cut up the paper, I, I tossed the paper, and then I am going to make a, to a, a sugar candy, right? By using uh, tape. And so what I'm going to do is I, I, did, I put the white tape first and then the red one. And voila, you see it looks really nice. I love how it came out. And then... I decided to like cut the top part, right? To lose the, the cover of the box. And then, yeah, if you want, uh, just a quick tip, lose the top first before you add the tape. And like that, you don't have to cut it like that, you know? Um, so yeah, just lose, uh, take the top off first and then add the tape and like that you don't have to do this like I did <laughs> sometimes I do things and I don't plan ahead and but sometimes they come really nice <laughs> okay guys so yeah so that's one of my tips and so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this hat in top of it and what I did was um, I put a scrunchie a hair scrunchie and then I decided to hide this little bun inside. And now if you want this hat to be a little bit uh, to, to show, you know, a little bit like upward, like if you want it to stand a little bit, just put a cup inside, like a plastic, a plastic cup, and it will look amazing. So there you go guys it's really nice i love the way it came out my son really liked this one <laughs> so i'm pretty sure your your children will definitely love this gift wrap so now okay so now for my fourth um DUI, i'm gonna be using this smaller uh box round box I'm gonna be tossing away this paper and I could have used the silver part but no I decided to um, to change it a little bit I I put it a sweater inside guys but you can see that it fit a sweater and it's super nice so what I did is I I put a double tape and then I put the this gold um, is gold round for usually for the Christmas tree and I put it around this box and this looks really nice then I added this red ribbon and it looks really nice now if you have gold ribbon gold lighter ribbon it will look uh, 10,000 better I don't have so just you know <laughs> that's one of my tips if you have gold ribbon it will look super nice or black I don't know I don't know I don't know if black will look better but you let me know okay so now for this fifth DIY I'm gonna be using this plastic 
um, container that you could also find it at the Dollar Tree. But since I didn't like these words, you know, I don't like this, all these words. Um, I decided to cover it up with this gift wrapping and I'm going to be using the black and white, right? And yeah. <laughs> and what I did is I, I cut off all the, the leftover, including the inside part, right? So I didn't need it that. Um, and then I decided also to put a tissue paper inside. And it looks really nice, guys. It looks really nice for gift wrapping. I came up with an idea because I was like, hmm, hmm, let me do something with this. <laughs> so yeah, this t this uh, t-shirt paper definitely blend in, and it looks really nice. And then I put this uh, cover that is original from this um, container. And there you go. It looks super nice. Now, for this DIY, I'm going to be using this can, um, this cookies um, can. Looks, uh, These cookies are so amazing. I, I don't know if you like them, but I do enjoy them and my family as well. The baby loves them too. Uh, <laughs> okay, so I do clean it very well. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to spray paint it. Um, I'm going to use gold um not shiny i'm not gonna use shiny gold this time and so i'm gonna add tissue paper and also inside i'm gonna be adding toys and some um candy now with these um container i'm gonna take everything out and then i'm gonna paint it in gold once i finish painting in gold then i I, I am going to add this straw that I just painted, right? And then I'm just going to put the, the part that bland, the bends. And then I'm going to open the holes, two holes only. And then I'm going to put this straw, right, inside. Just like you see. And I glue it in place with wax. And so I'm going to glue this top or the container in top of this can. And it will look so it look amazing then i'm gonna add this uh, shane it's a plastic shane in gold it looks really nice and guys i just came up with a huge ornament so it's really nice gold and you could put even letters in that area in the space and it will look amazing so yeah so i hope you like that one uh, for this diy i am going to be using this light bulb that is plastic. You can also buy it at Dollar Tree. It costs you a dollar only. And then I'm going to be using this as a gift by adding these earrings. And it looks really nice. Um, guys, these earrings, it was a gift um, for a lady that she did it on her. She has her home business and she do it by hand. It looks really nice. But unfortunately, I don't use earrings, um, you know. I don't I don't use earrings at all and I could definitely give it away if somebody asked me for those um, and they look really nice they're really cute if you want them just message me at my Instagram and the first one who definitely do that then they will take them I'm only in the United States because can I cannot do this outside the United States <laughs> um, so yeah but these are really nice I haven't used them at all they're super new and I'm just using them as a, as a, just to, to show you guys what I'm doing. Okay. And so now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to uh, insert this uh, wire inside. And then I am going to put a, a yarn, a piece of yarn. You could add, I think. After that, I decided, oh, why I didn't add a ribbon? I think a ribbon would look really nice. Um, and then when you open the gift, look what happens. That person would definitely not know that there's some earrings inside. Or what about a ring or a chain? So <laughs> this is a really good surprise for sisters, for girlfriends, or for, any, for anything. So yeah. It's a really nice surprise. So I hope you like it as well, guys. 
Now for this coming up DIY, I'm gonna be using these boxes that I bought at Walmart and I'm gonna be putting inside a apple cider. And then with this um, skirt from Dollar Tree, um, this is the skirt from the mini trees, guys. So just letting you know. And with this mini tree uh, uh, skirt, you could actually create your own, um, also your own hat, your Christmas tree hat. So that's what I'm creating right now. But it's actually gonna be long just to cover the whole apple cider bottle. And now I am going to make the puff ball by using chopstick and then I am going to round the wrap, round the all around the chopstick like quite a few times to get an actual white ball, right? And then I'm going to cut it up by with the scissors and it will look really nice. If you want to make it bigger, that's awesome as well, you know? <laughs> but it looks really nice and there you go I just did the Santa hat or the Christmas hat and I cover it up with this um, and I cover it up and nobody would know it would look a really nice gift guys <laughs> okay and now for this coming up DIY I'm gonna be using a box a round box correct and I am going to be taking away I'm gonna be taking off the um, the wax around the like the old glue, and yeah, it's super it's easy. Uh, you could even do it with your own um, nails. And then I'm gonna paint it in black. It looks super nice. And then I inserted this shirt for you guys can see that it definitely can you can put all uh, uh, stuff inside and it looks nice and then I glue this no flakes around it and it looks super nice guys I really enjoy this uh, gift wrap and I put uh, quite a few snowflakes around it and then I added this light around it too and it looks super nice guys and when you actually turn off the lights of your room this gift wrap will actually light up really nice and your gift will stand out so i definitely recommend it to glue that in place i put a double tape maybe you could use another tape that will not show um i totally recommend it but um this tape really show a little bit uh, but don't mind that <laughs> okay maybe you could use another option okay so now these um ornament i bought it at dollar tree totally plastic plus the foam the small foam that you could use it for snow and then I am going to insert all the foam inside this plastic ornament just I'm gonna fold it up completely okay once I fill it up I am going to put it on the side um, because then I am gonna get this round um, plastic a candy holder and then I am going to put the top upside down and then I'm gonna put this round ornament in top of it it will look really nice and then you're gonna see what I'm gonna do with this and then with an old towel that um, that I cut out out of a towel that I created my own pillow that you guys noticed in my previous video so I am going to make a scarf and then after that I am gonna get uh, these uh, red berries that you could buy at Dollar Tree as well and I'm gonna glue it in place and then this fabric that was left over from my, my previous video that I created some letters I am going to be cutting in a circle and then I'm gonna be using this top right and then I'm gonna cut it all up correct and glue it in place just like you see in the picture and then this long fabric that you see there I am also going to glue it on the side of this of this um, top there you go and I actually created a small hat
Okay, so now I'm going to glue it on top and correct on top of this um, plastic ornament. And then I am going to create with a black fabric that I had. Um, I am going to actually make some eyes. If you have buttons, buttons do it also. And I just called a piece of my brush, the end part, to make a, a, no, a nose. <laughs> okay, so I did a snowman, guys. And when you open it completely, you can get your candy. And look at that, guys. It looks really nice. And you can put it back, right? Just like that. And I'm pretty sure your children will definitely enjoy this because it is really nice, really creative. And you can eat your candy. <laughs> okay and now when i to finish this um to finish a snowman what i did is i used straws right um and i am going to glue them in place with wax correct if you want to paint them in brown for it could look like branches you could definitely do that um i think it's, it will look really amazing so now uh, this um, DUI, I am going to get this um, can, right, that I don't know what came inside. I think it's not mine. I don't know. And then I am going to paint them in place. I'm going to paint them correct. And what I did is the bottom part, I used black and the top one, the top cover, I used a gold. So now I'm going to be adding a snowflake with this chain plastic chain and I am going to uh, glue it with wax to glue it in place and it will look really nice guys for small presents for those who like small presents this is really nice and for these um, tags guys uh, for this Christmas tag I design it myself and I create them for you guys and I'm pretty sure your children and yourself will definitely love these tags because they're really easy um, they they're really awesome and I put a lot of effort into this and so you could go to my web page called allabanaturalyunica.com and you could find them there um, and all the way into gallery and so I'm gonna leave the in the description down below the links for you could definitely get access to those um, right you don't have to type it you just click on the link and you it will go directly to my website right and then you're going to encounter with three of them the three of them means uh they're different types so there's going to be the christmas tag without no words but you could if you want you could add words to your design or in color it right and then you're going to find the christmas tag that has uh, words in it so you could choose whatever you want it's totally free you could download it really easy to your computer and definitely you could um, enjoy these with your children and add it to your presents. And if you encounter with one of these ads on, all around my web page, just click at least one of them and it will definitely help me. <laughs> okay, guys, I really appreciate it. Hello, guys. Thank you for watching. Please don't leave and subscribe for more videos and give me a thumbs up. If you have any comments, leave them in the box down below. You can also follow me on my social media. Bye for now.